With this purchase, you will receive a cartoon zombie character that is fully rigged inside of Blender, has about 18 custom poses. The renders are super duper quick. Cycles is 17 seconds and four seconds in Eevee. Thanks for sticking through through the intro. Now we're gonna check out the overview. So basically just check out the timestamps in the description and just use the timestamps and go to the places that are interesting to you. So yeah, check out the timestamps. This Blender file was set up and used inside of Blender 3.22. This is the latest version and the previous versions like 3.1 and 3.0 will work fine but 3.3, 3.4 and whatever should also work fine. Just keep in mind if the Blender version is too old, the pose library might not work because the asset browser was only introduced in Blender 3.0. So keep that in mind. The rig is fairly detailed and really, really good. Um, let's go into the T pose from our action library where we have a bunch of poses, but we get into that later. But regarding the rig, it's very detailed. We can do a bunch of cool stuff. Yeah, moving, you can see here, let me show more of it. Let's uh, have him walk maybe. That's cool. You can step with his leg as well. Yeah, you can move the eyes, the mouth close as well, as well. Oops, that's not the mouth, that's the mouth. You can move this around as well. You can close the eyes as well. Let's do it like this the blink so that is the rig this is created in the latest blender so 3.2 or anything 3.0 will work we're using the new pose library which you can also access by going to asset browser and you can see a bunch of a bunch of them there but this is using that and to use it fairly simple make sure you are in pose mode so you select the character and you can't you can see it's not there so you make sure you go into the pose mode and then you will have to navigate to animations and there you can click on the poses and everything should work great just make sure in case you have for example this square select and you can see me moving around it only copies the frame for that square so just make sure you have nothing selected for the pose switching to work fine. Um, yeah, that's about it. Now we're at the exporting renders part of the video. To render, I'm going to be using Eevee because it's a lot quicker. Just go to the top left corner, click on render image, and we will should have it done in around yeah three seconds. I think the quality is pretty good. I don't have to render in cycles because the difference is going to be so minor. So yeah, uh, four seconds looks very good. We can save the image and do whatever we want. 